Buenos dias, everybody. I am here in Barcelona, Spain, here to talk to you about an interesting topic of how people are the way they are because that's what got them there. Or at least that's how they feel. For example, uh, let's say if you're angry at a, uh, at, a, at a boss who sucks. He doesn't listen to you, he doesn't, or she doesn't do what you want, and they're absolutely terrible. You hate them so much. Why do they have to be like that? Or maybe you don't like a politician of sorts, and uh, you really you hate the way they do things, and you hate the way they treat people, and they make, that you hate the, everything about them. Well, fun little uh, thing. Most humans, we learn patterns of being, and that those evolve and change as we grow up. Uh, and one of those patterns for somebody who's like a total jerk, like you're, you're angry, you're, you're mean, angry boss, right? Not saying it's right, but in his brain, he thinks that is what he needed to get to where he is now. Um, and again, I'm not saying that that's right at all, but uh, when you learn a thing and it's bred into you, and if you're getting, let's say your boss, you're getting promoted year after year, or however often you're promoted for being a certain way, it makes sense that that behavior would continue uh, as it's been rewarded. In the same way, you can also uh, find people who are super genuine, generous uh, and super genuine. Uh, these people, you know, they can be uh, just anyone, really. I mean, you're like a grandmother or like your store clerk can be super nice, just like they can be super mean. Um, in the case, an example for me, I was in Germany, I was in Berlin, and uh, I forgot my hat on the bus, and I was walking down the street already outside of the bus, and then I, I, I was wondering, I thought I lost my hat, and then uh, I actually turned around and I saw the hat fly out of the, of the door as uh, it was closing and as it was leaving. And that's amazing to me because I remember the old woman who I saw when I ran up, went over and grabbed the, uh, the hat. I looked in the window and I saw this older lady and she just, uh, I saw her on the second floor of the bus, which means she had to have, in the 10 seconds that I had left the bus, 15 seconds, she had to run down the bottom of the bus, throw out the hat, and then I saw her and was able to wave. So that woman, basically, to me, somebody who's willing to sacrifice her well-being as far as I'm concerned, because that, those staircases are not super easy to navigate. Um, for a hat, for me, for someone she doesn't know at all. And it's people like that that I believe uh, ought to make the world go round. Um, yeah, the generosity and stuff. Obviously for her, she's she's grown up with this belief or she's had it developed as, maybe it's as she aged. Maybe she started out as a really mean middle-aged woman or a middle, really mean young girl and she became a very nice old woman. Uh, for her, her incentive and her belief set in life is that that's a better way to be than not, than to be the angry, uh, resentful, uh, condescending boss, for example. But yeah. That's pretty much all I wanted to say today. Uh, people are the way they are because they think that's how they got there, you know, because they think that's how they have to be. And I have a whole other bunch of other topics about how, like, those are just the stories you tell yourself and how you believe that you have to do these things. But yeah, so um, with that said, I'm heading out here from Barcelona, off to my next stop of uh, Roma. And uh, yeah, with that said, we'll see you next time.